Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Game Aim Plus, where my aiming is gaming. I'm your host, the boy G, and oh, we're gonna talk about it. Let's talk about it. Alright, in this video, I wanna talk about Knuckles in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate 6 for the Nintendo Switch 2. Alright, Knuckles the Echidna. Everybody knows who Knuckles is. He is one of the most beloved and one of the most favorite characters of the whole Sonic series, okay, behind, you know, Shadow. So we're going to talk about Knuckles, all right? Another one of the, one of the characters that have sadly become one of the assist trophies in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. It was sad and just depressing. When I seen Knuckles pop out of the assist trophy, it was not a happy moment. I was not excited. I didn't like it. No. It's not cool. Knuckles is amazing. We've been waiting for a brand new Sonic uh, representation for Smash Bros. for the longest. We've had Sonic since Brawl. That's it. No Tails, no, no Knuckles, no Shadow, no Eggman, no Amy Rose, no nobody. Just Sonic. That's it. What the heck? Does, does Sonic not have other characters? Like, what is going on here? Let's bring let's bring Knuckles in to Smash Bros. It's long overdue. It should have been happened. All right, if you're not bringing Tails, you might as well throw Knuckles in. All right, everybody loves Knuckles. Okay, he's he's just the tough, super awesome echidna with the big knuckly fists and just always ready to fight and ready to protect his Chaos Emerald and Master Emeralds and all that. Bring him in the game. I'm already mad that he's an assist trophy and a spirit and a me outfit. Get all of that out of here. You can take you take it all, keep it, take it out of here. You can keep all that. Just give us Knuckles as a playable fighting character, please. He would be great. His moveset, obviously, it wouldn't it wouldn't even be that difficult. Okay, it'd be real, real simple. All right. You mean a lot of a lot of spinning attacks, a lot of punching, a lot of digging. All right. Listen. So the move set, right? B. Okay. If he used B with Knuckles, all right. Maybe we could charge it up. Kind of like, you know how Donkey Kong charges, you know, he winds up his punch. But let's say Knuckles would be, you press B, or you hold it down, either one, and he charges up his fist, and he gets like the red electricity around his fist. Kind of like the movie. Yeah, I said it. Just like Sonic the Hedgehog 2, the movie. I, I love that, how they express his power with, with the red electricity. I think that's super dope. So let's do that in Smash Bros. I think we should incorporate that, and I think it would just be really cool for Knuckles. I mean, I haven't seen anybody do that in Smash Bros. Like, put some red electricity on him. Like, that's fire. Or electrifying, whatever. So, you know, you press B, and he holds it down. And you can stop mid of it, and, you know, and keep loading it, and then, you know, keep it tucked in. You're ready to punch somebody. And then, of course, when it's fully charged, you can let it press B whenever you want, just like, just like Donkey Kong. And you catch somebody and you, just, you quick launch it like a quick punch right straight. Like with a red electricity, like red swipe strike. Like I think that'd be fire. Uh, something like that. Um, like his up B. I want to make his up B like slash recovery. Also like maybe like a spinning. Like he maybe he spins with his knuckles up. Right up into the air. Kind of like uh, Little Mac. But better. Like he'll, he can spin up, up into the air. But a little bit higher than Little Mac. But then he comes when he comes down he also... Spins down and and slams his knuckles down. So I think that'd be like a real cool like landing attack that could do a lot of damage and maybe a spike if you could actually land it on somebody in midair. But you don't want to do that because you're gonna come straight down. So it's gonna be scary if you miss. <laughs> but yeah, um, his side B right. I want his side B to be his glide. All right, everybody knows that knuckle can he can glide with his with his little little things behind his head. I don't know his dreads. I don't know what those things are. But his head, things spread out and he flies with it in his knuckles straight up. You know? So maybe you press side B, he, a little jump and then forward fly. And you could also use that as another recovery as well. But let's say you use that on the field or even as a recovery, if you do hit somebody with it, it won't do too much damage because you're not putting a lot of, Knuckles in him isn't putting a lot of force into that. He's just, you know, he's just chilling. Gliding up in there. What's up, man? What's up, dude? That's all he's doing. Saying what's up to his people's gliding, chilling. Somebody get caught, in, you know, into them knuckles, you're going you're gonna to get hit a little bit, get a little knockback. You're going to take some damage, but nothing too crazy that'll, like, KO you or anything. But, yeah. And also, if you do you knuckle onto a wall or a stage or something, I want knuckles to be able to... I want him to be able to climb up that wall. There should be no excuse why knuckles shouldn't be able to climb up that wall. But, so that way it's not too much cheating. He can't dig into the stage and he can't, like, hit 
while he's on the wall. Okay, we got to put some limitations to that. He can't hit and he can't dig into the ground or into the wall. So we just got to climb up. That's it. Climb up, climb down, climb up. But maybe, of course, there's like a time limit. You can't just stay stuck onto the wall forever hiding the entire battle. We can't do that. So give it a time limit. If he stays on too long, he just, you know, blinks and then falls. Like he starts to fall until, you you know, better, we better recover, do something. But, um, yeah, do that. His down B, um, it should be his digging thing. You know, he, he digs into the ground. That's what he does, searching for chaos, emeralds, treasures, all kind of stuff. So his down B, could, you know, he digs into the ground with his knuckles. And then you can actually stay the, underground, maybe like, like three seconds or something. And then you can actually see where you move underground in the game. Like, you know, maybe some like, you know, rockish dirt rubbly above, you know, on the ground as you move. But you got like three seconds. So you see that. And then, you know, uh, you can let out. You let go of B, release B whenever you want, and he pops up in the air with like an uppercut. You know what I'm saying? Or like that spin spin thing. Either one, uppercut or both, who cares? I don't care. Maybe maybe an uppercut, that'll be fire. He pops out with an uppercut and then, you know, strikes his enemy, you know, whoever his opponent is. I think that'd be dope right there. I don't see why not. A attacks, a lot of punches, maybe some kicks. And he'll throw some headbutts in there. I could see Knuckles hitting you with a big, he got a big head. His head is bonkers big. So, you know, bah, you know, maybe get you with a couple bah, bah, hits and maybe like a headbutt. I think that'd be fire. You know, his A attack, his aerial attacks too. Maybe some kicks, punches, you know, some knuckles and headbutts. I think that'd be dope. You know, nothing too crazy. Grabs, a lot of grabs where, you know, he grabs you, punches you, and then maybe like sumo, like sumo slams you, wrestle slams you, you know, slams you into the ground. I think that'd be cool. You know, some real violent hits. You know, because he would, he would be, he'd probably be like the same size as Sonic, you know, but of course not as fast, a little bit slower and heavier, of course, because he's going to be a powerhouse. He's going to be like a heavy character. Just... You know, he's not going to look super big. He's not going to be looking big like Bowser or King K. Roo or like, you know, King Didi or nothing like that. But he will be as strong as them, just he won't look that big. You know, and he'll move a little bit faster, but not as fast as Sonic, of course. that's That makes no sense. Okay, the Knuckles Echidna should not be moving as fast as Sonic the Hedgehog. Absolutely not. Um, so, yeah, do that. Um, smash attacks, you know, real, real simple, I don't know, knuckle hitting things, you know, um, maybe like the down smash, he could poof, slam to it, slam down poof, to the ground with his fist and poof, throw some dirt out or also like a, uh, you know, left and right smash. He could just poof, slam into the ground and poof, throw dirt forward. You know, I think like with rocks, like, I think that'd be really cool. You know, just to, to showcase knuckles strength, you know, I think that'd be really cool and not like it's just a regular punch because we already got that for the B move. So we don't want to do that again for his, you know, his smash attack. So his left and right smash, he, you know, he knocks down to the ground with both of his knuckly fists. And then, you know, slams the dirt and rocks. Um, listen, I'm still not ideas. I just think this is really, really cool. Knuckles is awesome. There's a moveset they could come up with him. You know, they, they could throw a couple of, you know, spin dashes and homing attacks. If they want to throw it in there, cool. But don't give him too many spinny attacks. We don't need him looking like a little ready ball of Sonic. We don't need that. Let Knuckles be his own entity, his own character. But we understand if you have to put at least a homing attack or some type of spin attack on it because it just makes sense. It's, that's just, it's part of the whole Sonic thing. Everybody turns into a ball, so why not? So do all of that for Knuckles. Um, you know, uh, his final smash. His final smash, I don't know, he just, just beat the crap out of you. I really don't really have anything for you. Maybe you could turn into Hyper hyper Knuckles. You know, get the Chaos Emeralds, turn into Hyper Knuckles or something and just beat the crap out of you. As, like, kind of beat you, kind of like Donkey Kong and like Little Mac does. You know, but maybe as he's beating you, it's going, like the camera's going all the way around him. Like, I think that's dope. You see the back of him, the front of him, the side of him. You know, make it like a little 3D-ish, like, animation, but I think it look, it'll make it look real dope as he's beating you up rapid speed with his knuckles and then, you know, the last one with a big old knuckle to the face. Then just let send you launching up out of here. All right, his stage could be uh, Angel Island. Angel Island, that's the the place where you know Knuckles the Echidna resides on. That is his place. That is his island. That's what he does. That's where he be laying out, chilling. You know what I'm saying? By the little river, Lake John. You know what I'm saying? With the waterfall and you know little little leaves and stuff and all that coming down with the trees. That's where he be at. Leave. That's that's gonna be Knuckles' stage. I don't know how they'll make the stage the Angel Island, but they'll work it out. It's like a floating island too, so that'll be kind of dope. Maybe if you follow the island, don't follow the island. If you follow the island, you're done. Dead, it's over. So make something with that. Alright. And then bada bing bada boom. There you go. You got knuckles, baby. He's ready to go. He is out of the assist trophies. He is out of the me outfit. He is out of the spirit. Take all that out or keep it. I don't care. Except for the assist trophy. Don't keep that. Make him a character. Stop playing with us. Obviously, he is movable, playable. Y'all can do it. Just take him out of the assist, turn him into a whole character. You're done. You're welcome. Yeah. But <laughs> There you go, man. That's all I really got. I just wanted to talk about Knuckles because he should be in Smash Bros. This is like 
it's just ridiculous now. Like, come on, y'all are being crazy. Put Knuckles in Smash 6. Let's see what's up. I'm ready to use the Knuckles and punch people. But, um, yeah, that's all, I, that's all I got, guys. You know, you let me know if you like Knuckles. If you don't like Knuckles, do you want him to smash? Do you not want him to smash? Put it in the comments. Talk to your boy and let's chitty chat. But, yeah, there you go, guys. Game Aim Plus. Please subscribe. Click that little bell button. That way, every time I upload a new video, it'll pop up on your phone like, you feel me, dog? You feel me. But, yeah, y'all have a great morning, afternoon, night, whatever it is, wherever you're at. And I'll catch you in the next one. Boo, y'all. Woo!